All right. Well, welcome to day six of seven days. Um, I'm here, not in my room, and I'm going to be perfectly honest. So I've already played through this day. Um, what happened was my microphone did not record the first time I played it through. So all my initial scares and whelps um, were not recorded. So <clears throat> now I'm having to play it through again with a working mic. So I'm um, sorry if I'm not as scared as I was originally, but you'll never know how scared I was. Wop, wop, wop. Anywho, so these guys are actually pretty cool. There are a lot of things about this quote-unquote day that I uh, enjoyed. For instance, these little wicker guys, you think they're harmless, um, but as you go on, you find that, ooh, creepy, they follow you around. Now, at first, you only think it's that one guy. When in reality, there's a bunch more. And they just keep following you around throughout the entire uh, level. Which is really creepy. Sometimes they can actually be kind of annoying. Um, considering they get in your way a lot. But basically, I'm just going to go around and let these guys go. And grab this key. Because I need it. Um, but yeah, initially I was really freaked out when these little guys started uh, following me around. Um, and those, like, sounds you hear are them moving. Wow. <laughs> Creepily close to you. Um, just gonna let all these guys out. Hmm, that's weird. Oh, wait. <laughs> I have a key. Screwdriver. Screwdriver is very handy in this uh, night, day, nightmare thing. Um, just let the these guys out. Of course, there's a whole gang. You guys ready for this? Turn around and boom! There's the whole guy, uh, the whole gang. <laughs> anyway, I'll open this. There is a lot of ventilation shaft on this day. All right, so. In this room, you find Sam in the middle of the room, sort of just chilling inside this cage thing. And guess who's joining you, too? Little wood guys are here, coming through the ventilation shaft as well. Um, so I'm just going to go around here. Have these guys follow me. work up my courage to walk up to Sam. Hey Sam. On which side of the bar is, is the prisoner? Ha ha ha. Well it's you're on that side. You're in the cage buddy. Ha ha ha. Sucks to be you. Ha ha. I'm a free man. And suddenly I'm in the cage. You can't know. Fear creates the cage. Ha ha. This initially really freaked me out. I was like, whoa! Because then at one point, there's the little wicker guy in there with you. Sam's on the outside. And then Sam's on the inside with you. Oh boy, run. Oh god, I forgot that happened. Uh, uh, and then, uh, hold on, where's that stupid ventilation shaft? All the while, these wicker guys are following you. Um, God damn it. Yep. Here we go. There you go. 
guys really need to back up and give me some room to operate here. Jeez. Can a guy get a little bit of privacy? Jeez. Jeez Louise. Anyway, so let me go through this ventilation shaft, yada yada yada, boo boo hoo. Let me, uh, I think it's like, well, I don't want to spoil too much because you're going to see it in a bit. I'm one of those gamers that's very much about the experience of the game and um, I don't like ruining things for people. I'd rather have them play through it themselves and sort of, you know, have those feelings stirred within them that the game originally stirred in me, which, I, you know, I think is what gaming is all about, but enough preaching. I'm in the ritual room now. So, there's a pentagram. Six nooses. And a little pedestal in the middle. There are six holes in the tablet. Uh, tablet. Wow, on the table. I wonder why. Don't be afraid of those who only want to help you. Whoa! And then it turns out our little guy friends here are strung up. Um. You gotta open the door. Locked. And uh, we're missing one guy still. Uh, let me go try to open the door again. Maybe he'll show up. There are six holes in the table. I wonder why. Where's the last guy? Oh, no. Did I not let him out of his room? I'm gonna be very upset if I didn't let him out of his room. Oh no. Oh no. Wait, hold on. Oh no, am I gonna have to oh god, this sucks so much. Sorry guys. Kinda of ruined everything. I like that I can run while I'm crouching. Seems like an odd talent. So there should be six little guys. Which means there should be six rooms, at the very least. Nothing in this one. See, in my rush to you know, get to the end of the level, I forgot something. Must have missed a key somewhere. Damn it. Oh, there you go, guy. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, I'm creeped out. Just follow me. You coming, Jimmy? Thank you. Alright, well, this is where <laughs> we complete the ritual thingamabob. Now, this is really annoying because I have to go back again when, after I deliver this little guy, I'm going to have to go back and, you know, fetch something again. So, it's kind of really annoying. Alright, do 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 Let me go try this door again. Wink. Oh no, it's locked. What am I to do? Oh no. The ritual is set. Let me just touch the fire. I feel like I've lost something. Hmm, what have I lost? Oh, wait a minute. That blood wasn't there before. Oh my, what could it be? Let's find out. <laughs> so yeah, this is what I was talking about. I'm not going to have to go all the way back again. <clears throat> and uh, da, 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 da. let me just rush through this. 
so I feel like I've lost something. And then if you look at here, it's a heart. I'm presumably my beating heart. Heart. Freaking! And then I have to go back and toss it into the fire. It's gonna, it, again, the first time I played this uh, night, I was just like, what the fuck? Um, sort of desensitized to it now, but still, you know, really some real dark tones to this particular night. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and toss into the fire. Whoa! The sound of the fire is really loud and <laughs> particularly startling. So I'm going to take the blood key that I got from that little ritual and use it to open this door. And I forget if I get scared or not here. I think I do. Let me just run down this hallway blindly. Dude, Oh, that's right, I have to... You know, last time I went through the right, I'm going to go through the left this time. Um, I did get scared uh, when I went to the right, but I'm guessing it's going to be the same deal. If I go to the right. Da, 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 da. Okay, so see, you guys get to experience something, Whoa. something new with me. This didn't happen in the last one, when I went to the right. Oh, great. Did I have to go to the right? I did have to go to the right, didn't I? God damn it. Well, so much for that excitement. Jesus Christ. Alright, let's get this night over with and then finish up this game. Whoop. Endless ventilation shaft. Any day now, thank you. Uh, just give me the note already. Ooh, big scare! Actually, oh, that's right, I forget that I actually end up back in my actual room. And reading this note ends the night, obviously. So, oh, oh, no, no, oh, oh damn, I forgot about this. Yeah, so I start having like a little the panic attack seizure thing. I try to go to bed. I'm not sleepy, I just, oh, you look confused. <laughs> Anything the name Sam. Uh, I feel like this game was originally made in another language and then roughly translated to English. Stay away from what holds you back. Uh, follow the darkness. Freaking. And that actually ends the night. So, join me next time, and we shall finish the game. Whoop, whoop.